Overall, our patient care group are a fantastic resource for the school. They're a source of inspiration to our students and our staff. I've really enjoyed working with the patient and care group and all my lectures and small group work that have been led by members of the group have just been so interesting because they've been able to put all the theory we've learned in the uni into real life context to remind us what we're studying for. Patients meet our students in the very first weeks of our course, so-called induction, but they don't just meet our patients one-to-one -one and in groups, they're also meeting our, our patients through our online platform called Patient Knows Best. And developing those two skills, the face-to-face -face and online, is so vital for care in the 21st century. I have a lifelong disability. I've been involved with the patient and care group for many years, and currently I'm involved as a co-tutor with some online learning and taking part in a research project. Well, I'm able to talk about medication, discuss the role of medication, and discuss the sort of challenges um, I face. And through that, I'm able to look at what students may encounter and help people and patients to help themselves. So I found that the Patient Knows Best programme, um, it's developed my communication skills. It's come very useful in my GP placement where I've had to write down notes from patients over the phone or in person and it's helped with writing discharge summaries for example in the hospital during the placement. I met service users at my interview, again at the interprofessional training and once again recently at a genetic session. At the genetic session this incredible lady that co-tutored really helped me understand the impact of birth defects on people's lives. The qualities and expertise that they are willing to share with our students are so invaluable that go so far beyond that of being simply a service user. They're phenomenal and the students actually love them.